Hi my lovely people! Welcome back to another fabulous vlog. This is a Christmas holiday vlog that I have been meaning to post. Finally get a chance to do this on Christmas Day. Merry Christmas to all of you who are celebrating. I am very excited. I'm of course recording this before Christmas, but I'm very excited to celebrate Christmas with my family. We actually just returned from a very fun adventure at Enchant. Here they they put on this gorgeous winter wonderland kind of thing at the National Park Stadium. And we went there, we saw Santa, and we did some skating, and they had a beautiful, like, like gorgeous Christmas light displays. So they had like light mazes and everything. It was so much fun. So that'll be at the end of the vlog. But in this vlog, I will take you all on some Christmas shopping to several of my favorite places. I also bought something fabulous at Louis Vuitton, but the unboxing will be, of course, done in a different video. We also went to the White House. We got to tour the White House. So a lot of really fun stuff in this video. So. I hope you're excited to watch it. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and ring the notification bell so you will never miss any of my videos. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram and TikTok. So let's get right to this vlog. So here at the mall, I have to go into several stores and get some stuff. Those um, gorgeous gardenia and jasmine in gift sets. Um, the elixir, Burberry. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering if I have something I want to get at Chanel. Okay, here's the Chanel counter. I have to go get a Le Beige powder really quickly. Um, yeah, here it is. One of them. I thought I would be in an N40, but actually N30 is better. And now, even Macy's has the Chanel holiday collection here. Well, they were out of my shade N30. That's weird, you guys. I thought I would be in an N40. Uh, even N40 is too light. I'm usually like an N, like a 50 in Chanel. Yeah, that, that, was, that was surprising. I'm um, also a little paler for winter, I guess. Um, might have to get a different shade for winter, I mean summer. So I had to go to Lush after Sephora, but I want to go to Sephora first. They're having that fragrance sale right here. So, so you guys, I want to get a few things here actually i'm thinking i might just get the one thing here that i've always been planning okay so here's what i want to get i want to get the gucci flora gorgeous jasmine not a huge fan of gorgeous gardenia i mean it's pretty but it's not that like super pretty or anything okay so let me yeah this one is super super pretty it's uh, got a little slight hint of fruitiness, but it's very much a jasmine fragrance. It's got some other like magnolia and other white florals too. It smells amazing. Very clean, fresh sort of spring, summer scent, but especially in spring, it should be really pretty. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna grab. Love the new Killian, um, you know, like the less expensive line, I forget what it's called. You know, they come in these square bottles now. I love that. I didn't, I wasn't a huge fan of the big glow bottles. They were very awkward and hard to store. I'm also going to grab my husband one of these. The, the Spice Bomb Night Vision. I'm definitely grabbing one of them for my husband. This one right here. Hey guys, this is Give. Um, Gwen Stefani's Give. These lip glosses are amazing, especially this one. This is Sweet Tooth. This is really good such good lip glosses and these sparkles they're really good the eye sparkles 
not a huge fan of the new Fenty fragrance. I mean, it's pretty. It's just like another, just another white floral kind of fragrance. It's nothing special. I mean, I'm smelling it right now. I mean, it's got the usual neroli, that type of fragrance. I mean, notes, some vanilla. I mean, it's okay. It's not special. So before I go to Bloomingdale's, I'm going to go into blooming tails and Nordstrom I have to I have left to go but I want to go to Lush and get my bath bombs that I love and I ran out of them I'm gonna grab a roast jam or two this is good I always get the clouds over there right there I get at least four or five of them this guy's walking my way when he moves I'm gonna get like you know four or five of those so I'm grabbing like 10 of these two guys. I love this. This is so good. It's got a little bit of lavender too. I gotta grab a candy cane and a bubble gum for my daughter right here. Then I love these ones, the lavender um, ones right here. You just hold these to the, the faucet in the bathtub in the good to the water. And then that's how you like dissolve it. It's got it creates a lot of bubbles. Ooh, look at this glittery gold one it's called golden angel i wonder what that is it looks like a sweet honey toffee kind of scented one hmm. i also got a unicorn horn for my daughter look at these lip scrubs these are not nice They're very organic um it's just sugar scrubs but look at different flavors i didn't realize they had lip scrubs so i mean duh, i should have known I used to get deck scrubs too, but I have other body scrubs that I love now. So I'm gonna no go in the Nordstrom. I wanna go to Chanel counter there. I gotta get my powder that I have been trying to get. Keep selling out, annoying. Here's the Chanel counter. I'm gonna go get my powder really quickly. One of my sales gals here, she's really awesome my essay that I love. Oh, there she is. Okay, got my, got my, my powder. Um, now I need to go shop for my husband. I just, I've gotten everything I need for him, but I need to do some more, like a, a small, couple of small things that I'm looking for him that I need to get, so. Oh, he, do you hear the song, you guys? It's the uh, raindrops. Yeah, the, what do you call it? Sound of music song it's such a holiday song gosh i don't know what i'm looking for where i'm supposed to go i get lost in the men's department so now going to bloomingdale's Men's fragrance and skincare just for men. Here's the Creed, uh, Creed Boutique. My San Francisco John Boutique. It's actually several. They have Mancera Montal, Parfums de Marley, and all of that. But you guys, I really have all of this. I mean, what more perfume would I buy? I've basically got all of the Miss San Francisco John fragrances that I want. Oh, this one looks intriguing. Let's see. Ooh, this one's spicy. Ooh, very uh, masculine. La Gem. Okay. Bagari La Gem. Looks like gem collection. They've got little stones on the lids here. Ooh, this one's very interesting. This is very citrusy. Oh wow, that one's really interesting. It's this one. Wow. These are all very strong kind of scents. They're definitely very masculine linen. What's this? Chili, vanilla, what are all these? Ooh. Allegra. Oh, these are beautiful. Let's see. Let me try the patchouli one. Ooh, very patchouli. Ooh, beautiful though. It's kind of like beautiful in the same way. 
Big Glow 55 is. Actually, ooh, this one's very vanilla. This one's vanilla, it says right here, but I tell you. Oh, it's a very creamy and beautiful vanilla. You guys, I might get one of these. Oh, they have myrrh, they have rose. This has bergamot, musk. Oh, I want to try the musk one. Oh, that's super musky. It's a very, very interesting, sexy musk. I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. And this gardenia and vanilla, this red one, I'm intrigued by. Oh, actually, they have the caps here. So I can sniff the caps. They have the scent caps here. This is very interesting. The gardenia and vanilla. This one is rose and raspberry wow this is really cool you guys they these scents are very intriguing um musk heliotrope this one hmm, interesting but i'm more interested in this right here i think the vanilla here was quite something this one right here this was quite something you know what they had the scent caps here too I did not even see, but you know what? It's not, I, I'm glad I sprayed it because there's no scent left in that. I don't know, I'm going to walk around with it a little bit because it seems like it's disap It's kind of starting to disappear on my uh, hand. I hope not. It seems like it. Walk around a little bit and see if it disappeared. If it doesn't disappear, then I'll be back to get it. Salutore Faragamo. Verstarte. I have all this in the other luxury complex that I usually go to, so I might just go there. So now we have to go to American Girl to get my little girl a, an American Girl doll. She gets to pick her own doll and everything. So I'm gonna wait here. I just called my husband and the kids to come and join me here. So when she comes here, I'm going to let her pick any doll she wants or two from American Girl doll. It's part of her Christmas you know, surprises, but I didn't want to pick out the doll for her. I wanted her to have it, the experience of picking them out herself. I have a nice little cafeteria here that I can get a drink. So she gets to pick whatever she wants. She's looking for what she wants. <laughs> She's very excited. There she goes. She's looking. From Hawaii, mm. 1941. Oh, so this one actually, this is the one I was talking about. Oh, okay. Did you hear that? Do you want that so or do you want 19, like one of so these? 1940, so, Nanea's 1941 story oh. around like the bombing of Pearl Harbor. She came downstairs because she wanted to get a truly me doll, a one that's like her. Oh, and these are tiny ones, are cute too. Oh my goodness. Okay, what do you want? Get anything you want. She's being very picky as to what she wants. She's so uh, selective, like your mommy. All right, here it is. Hold it up. We got the we got Everything. the big doll, and we got the matching outfits. We got an outfit for her, and the matching outfit for the doll, and two other outfits for the doll. So yeah, there you go. <laughs> you happy? Yeah. Okay. So here at the other mall to get it. Just look around a few and try to look at a few more things. I don't know. I don't know exactly what I want. So, I'm thinking about going to Louis Vuitton. There was something that I've always thought about, well, you know, maybe I want to get. And check that out today. I go to Nemes. 
Sí. The fragrances I have basically sniffed everything under the sun. Okay. Um, what am I looking for? Nest candles. Baby cat is not here, but I want to try this rouge velour. Ooh, this one smells really nice. I like it. Rouge velour, jumpsuit, cabin blouse, trench, tuxedo. I've heard a lot about tuxedo. Mm, it's actually really nice. It's actually very kind of masculine, but a woman could pull it off. Wild leather, that definitely intrigues me. Oh, ooh, that's strong. That's super strong. Supreme bouquet sounds like a floral one. Mm, it's really nice. Hi, do you guys have baby cat? It's still in Paris. Okay, so I put my name down for baby cat. Um, talked to the girl yesterday there. She took my information and she's going to to message me when baby cat gets in here. Uh, apparently hasn't made it to US yet. Uh, it's been out for a year and it's still not here. Now I'm gonna go to Louis Vuitton, you guys. Check it out and I wanna, <laughs> there's something I wanna get from there. Okay, here we are at Louis Vuitton. I'm gonna go in and check out what I want. Yeah, I'm at Saks, Saks Fifth Avenue. Um, it's not all of this stuff before, guys. Oh, I have every MFK that is under the sun. I might get like a feminine Purell someday, but I don't know. I just, uh, I don't know. My Dior boutique, I always call and buy all the Dior Privé stuff here. I bought so much that they, uh, they have me on their speed dial, pretty much. They call me every time they have something new and I can't think of anything that I really want. No, I think I'm okay. No, I didn't know we had a Killian here. Oh. So you guys, there's the rose hood, my, my lover my beautiful love and i'm looking for that that one with the pair of lips or whatever that you can't get anywhere else so beautiful i love killian you guys know i love killian is my one of my two top very favorite fragrance houses that's my beloved killian rose oud the new release it's not a new release it's been around but the new i don't know if they changed the formulation or not but this one's fabulous divine He's looking up the uh, one I want. So here's the kiss from the rose. Um, this I noticed too, and it's not available anywhere. It's not one of those other things that you can't find anywhere. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the kiss from a rose. It's a rose musk vetiver kind of fragrance. It's absolutely gorgeous. So he says that he gets a lot of compliments on this fragrance. And you no, know, you know, this is my beloved. This is my love. This is my my darling and now this one kiss from a rose that's not available this is not available anywhere but like on killian and um and in like stores like this this is sax of course so i'm getting a deluxe size of the love don't be shy ex um not extreme love don't be shy so that's what i'm getting with the fragrance yay there's my box right there he's getting it ready So I got my Killian, my gorgeous Killian Kiss from a Rose, you guys. And then I got my Louis Vuitton, but I will show it to you guys. I have to actually come back to pick it up. They're gonna prep it. So I have to come back and get it. So I'll show you my Louis Vuitton here when I go home, okay? I mean, just the bag and the box. The unboxing will come in a different video later, okay? You guys, okay, here it is. Here's the Louis Vuitton bag. 
I got it. Uh, I, I got some stuff. Okay, so we'll show the. I'll show you the unboxing in a different video. So this is what I got. If you can, uh, if you can, kind of guess what it it might be. It's a pretty big box. So yeah. So I'll do the unboxing in a separate video after Christmas. Hey guys, we're gonna go on a White House tour here. Through my work, um, I arranged for us to go on a tour of the White House during the holidays. So we're gonna go do that here in a few minutes. I'm gonna take you along with us. <music> So you guys, we just finished the uh, White House tour and we're here at the uh, Ted's. Uh, this is one of our favorite restaurants. So we just finished the White House tour. We're having dinner here. They have uh, bison here, bison burgers and bison steaks and stuff like that. It's really delicious. I love this place. So there's the bison right there. They have all these bison burgers and everything.
interesting thing. Drink. Looks like a light bulb. He's like, that's a real Christmas tree. <laughs> show the show the Christmas tree.